create something like this you have to open your pizza lab when you open your pizza lab you are going to see an interface like this then what you are going to do is to tap on this icon to change the background so let's say for this um let's change our background to white so let's say change this background so you can use any color you like just change your background then tap on the plus button here to add a shape now we are going to add the shape then at this place this is what you are going to do tap on this guide icon to add the guide so we are going to have this guide just follow up what i'm doing make sure this magnet tool is on just tap on that to on it then the next thing tap on this icon you are going to on all this so that it will be easy for you to bring out your ship then tap on this icon for this input we are going to put uh, five for the first one the second one we are also going to put five and tap on the good button so we have five five here look at it the first one the um, horizontal guys we have five vertical guys we have five when you are done setting tap on ok then we have this guide then close it by tapping on this other icon again then we have it like this now this is our shape then use this point to scale down your shape like this so for this one we are going to be having this kind of shape so you just follow up depending on what you are looking for so look at when i um, drag the shape it, it snaps to the center of this page now i'm going to tap on the ok button then let me remove the the guideline so that you see what i'm doing so the next thing you want we are going to do now is to select the shape and duplicate select it then go to this icon go to this icon just tap on it here you can see copy among this option you can see copy tap on the copy to copy so we have a copy of this let's turn back our guide on so that we can match it very well so it this one is at the middle of the page okay so let's turn this off so we have this use this um, point to scale it up so we are going to turn back our guide so we are going to make it match bring it to the center take it again bring it to the center so let's take it a um, little bit closer so let's remove this and take it a little bit closer like this okay the next thing you want to duplicate this shape again tap on the copy icon to duplicate it take it to this other side make sure that they are on the same line this line and this line are the same line this line and the bottom side are the same line okay so we have this the next thing is to duplicate it again tap on one of them go to copy to copy it so this one let's bring it here make sure they are on the same line use the bottom line to take it down then take it over to this shape now we are going to change the color of this so that we can see what we are doing select the shape go to this other icon just tap on this scroll down you will see color tap on color so here let's pick a red color and tap on ok after selecting the color so what we are going to do here is to push it inside so that it overlaps the white shape so let's put it inside just a little bit like this okay something like this now let's copy it again and take it to this other side the same thing just push it inside so that it overlaps then the next thing we are going to duplicate this shape again but this time around we are going to change the color to white okay so go to your color and change the color to white so we are going to tap on color and pick white. select white like this then bring it over to match the same size just like this so what we are going to do is to tap on this other side to reduce it bring it over again and tap on this other side to reduce it so we have this so now copy it again and take it to this other side so that we have the same thing on the both side so we have the same thing now on the both side of this image so the next thing you want to do is to go to your layer panel now this is our layer panel just tap on that then here you can see all the layers that con controls this design what we are going to do is to tap on this icon just tap on it and select tap inside this dot to select all these layers just tap on each of them select all of them like this now tap on this other icon to merge all the layers so tap select ok and we have merged all the layers so select the layers and go down here tap on this icon 
tap on it, then scroll down, you will see what we call erase color. You can see erase color. So select the erase color, enable it using this toggle button, enable it and you can see the white color is gone. But we want to keep the white color and remove the red color. So the, what we are going to do is to tap on this color picker, tap on this color picker, then use your finger on your screen and pick the red color. Look at it. Then tap on the OK button here. So we have a white color back. Then we are going to play around with our tolerance because you can see we have uh, we have a, a remaining red along the edges of this shape. So we can increase the tolerance until we don't have that um, this tolerance until we don't have that red again. So just tap on it to increase it so that we don't have the red again. So the red is gone now tap on the ok button select the ok button and we have this so what we are going to do now is to remove the background and save this image as png to do that tap on this icon tap on this then tap on transparent look at transparent select that and we don't have any background now we have to save our image as png tap on this icon to save it as png save as image here you can see our default png is selected now tap on the save to gallery so that this image can be saved so now let's open a new uh, project by clicking here select new project like this so we have a new project now let's bring back our ship into this design to do that tap on this plus button then tap on from gallery to bring back this um same image back so select the image and we have the select the ok button then scale it up to fold the entire screen just like this. So we have something like this. So from here, you can decide to change the background. If you want to change the background, you can simply tap on this icon to change the background. Um, let's tap on this icon. Let's make this background the color I used. So let's see this color. Okay, so let's say this blue. Okay, so then select the um, image that we just imported. Now go over to this icon, this particular icon, select the icon. Then scroll down and you will see texture. You can see texture here. Okay. Select the texture. Then tap on this icon. This icon. That image icon to select the image that you want to insert into this ship. This is the image I want to use. Look at the image. Tap on the OK. As you can see the image has been inserted into the icon. You can use this key. If it's not inserted properly, you can use this key to, to you can increase this key. Just like this, you can see the image goes up and does that. Then when you're done, tap on the OK button. Tap on the OK button and you have something like this. So you can play around with stroke and um, play around with shadow and all that. And you have this design.